Hi everyone, this is Dave, and in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at this smartphone from Wiley Fox. This is the Swift 2X. So here we go, this is the Wiley Fox 2X, and this is a fantastic smartphone, it really is. The pricing is just about right on this, and it's got some great specifications as well. Inside, we've got a Snapdragon 430 octa-core processor, three gigabytes of RAM, 32 gigabytes of storage. You can extend that storage up to an additional 64 gigabytes via a micro SD card. This is the slot for the SIM card and the micro SD card just inside here. Now, up front, we've got a really nice screen. This is a 5.2 inch IPS display, 1920 by 1080 resolution. Around the back, we've got a 16 megapixel camera this has got an f2 aperture. I'll show you some photos I've taken with this in a short while. We've also got a dual LED flash, fingerprint reader as well, Wiley Fox branding, which is nice and subtly done, and a nice quality of material used on the back as well, sort of a gunmetal grey finish. Now, if we go back round to the front, you can see here that we have got a front-facing camera, of course, as with all smartphones nowadays, and this is a very generous 8 megapixels. Inside, we've got a 3,010 milliamp hour battery. Battery life on this is absolutely superb. Because this is quite sort of modest specifications, that battery easily gets you a full day and a half between charges. Now to charge that battery, we've got a USB type C connector on the bottom, and that supports Qualcomm Quick Charge 3. On the side here, we have of course got the main power on off button, and also the volume rocker and we have got an additional microphone up the top and a three and a half millimeter audio jack. Now this is running Google Android version six. Uh, it's also got Cyanogen mod on it as well. And we've got this sort of different uh, sort of overlay or different take on Google Android. We can dive into the gallery and take a look at some of the photos I've taken. And the camera is a little bit on the slow side to actually focus but the results are really very, very good indeed. Now these are all taken with the rear facing camera, so 16 megapixels, nice uh, color accuracy on the subscribe pillow. Very, very pleased with that. If we go across to the next photo, now this is a poster that I've got in my studio. And again, the colors are so, so accurate. And if we zoom in, we've got a nice amount of detail as well. We go across to the next photo. This is just of some of my camera gear. And again, it's even picked up the dust on that grip area there. Very, very good indeed. And we've got a picture of a watch here. This was a little bit more tricky. It seemed to sort of struggle with the light. Now this wasn't a low light photo, but I think the reflections coming off the top of this speaker unit uh, did sort of trick the camera a little bit and it just overcompensated, a little bit too much grain. But again, in the same light here, We've got a picture of one of the watches I'm currently looking at, and it's just superb. Very, very good indeed. A really good result with regards to the actual uh, quality of the photos produced by this smartphone. Day-to-day -day use, the uh, performance is really very good. You do see some lag, uh, very minimal lag when transitioning between screens, but for the most part, the performance is very, very good indeed. I like the fact that we've got Qualcomm Quick Charge 3 technology. The speaker, although it's not particularly loud, is nice and clear. And overall, using this for making calls is fine. Communications, things like social networking, absolutely superb. This is by no means a high-end smartphone, but the build quality is very, very good indeed. Wiley Fox do a fantastic job with their smartphones and they haven't disappointed with the Swift 2X. If you're in the market for a nice specification smartphone without paying uh, a lot of money, then this is well worth checking out. This is the Wiley Fox 2X. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, as always, please do hit that like button. Check out the links down in the video description to where you can pick up one of these for yourself. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in another video very soon.